some people have said that they come here to die and of course sometimes they're afraid. It's a satisfaction to help them transition and that they come here to live and, and live the rest of their life. Not this is the last step. They might be at home and a day feels like a year, I've heard people say, and they come here and there's so many things to do that they can be as busy as they want if they want to be by themselves um, and have some quiet time they can. If they want to participate in all the activities, they can do that. So that provides a lot of satisfaction for me. And people think getting older, depression is a normal part of aging and it's not but unfortunately it is something that comes up fairly often and we can help catch them so they don't fall. When I was invited to do admissions, one of the things that we noticed was when people would move in, they had a certain amount of anxiety and fear and apprehension about what's it going to be like, what's going to happen, and there was a lot of um, flurry the first day they moved in, paperwork and people in and out, and we noticed that that can make someone pretty anxious, rightfully so. So we came together and made up the admission team, and our goal is to always meet someone ahead of time in their home or if they're in the hospital, and then we can interview and get some of the paperwork out of the way, and at the same time, it's really been successful in easing people's anxiety that when they move in, I can wait at the front door on the bench and, and greet them. And even if they can't remember my name, often they'll remember my face like, I know you from somewhere.